Hey developer and welcome once again to another Cold World video. We're always learning new stuff and working as well with new tools. One of those new tools is a 4K UHD monitor. As regular, with high resolutions, the font size specified in pixels decreases until it becomes quite difficult to read for the human eye, at least a normal one. So in Windows 10, it's necessary to adjust the scale at the system level, so every application can have a decent size to operate with it. Unfortunately, not every program accepts this configuration and remains working as usual, in this case NetBeans. As you can see in this demo, the UI is totally unusable because it is too small even for a simple click on the icons. In this video, we will explain you two ways to optimize Apache NetBeans so you can use it properly on your 4K monitor. The first option that can help you to optimize NetBeans in your 4K monitor is to simply increase the font size of the menu and the editor itself. The only disadvantage of this option is that the icons will remain small, as they are not vectorized images but plain PNGs. However, the text won't feel blurry at all. As long as you increase the font size enough, most of the UI will remain sharp. To get started, open another text editor in your system. We will use Visual Studio Code. Don't forget to launch it with administrator rights. Then, search for the netbeans.com file located in the etc. directory inside the netbeans installation directory. Search for the netbeans default options key that contains a plain string as value. Append at the end of the string the new font size parameter with the value of the new font size. In this case, we will set it to 32, which is quite enough for us. Save the changes and close the file. Now with the previous step, the NetBeans menu will be readable, as it has a decent size relative to the resolution of the monitor. You will need to change as well the font size of the code editor. You can easily do this through the configuration of NetBeans, so open it from the executable or a shortcut. As you can see, the font size of the menu is great, but the code remains tiny. To fix this, go to the Tools option in the toolbar and select Options. In the Options dialog, go to the Fonts and Colors tab and increase the font size as you want. We will set it to 36, which is initially good for us. Lastly, although this should be already configured on your system unless you want really tiny icons around your desktop on the traditional interface of Windows, working at the 4K resolution, just to be sure, verify that the scale and layout of Windows is higher than 100%. To do this, do right-click on the desktop and from the drop-down menu select Display Settings. Select the screen with the 4K resolution and go down to the Scale and Layout option. Select the screen with the 4K resolution and go down to the Scale and Layout option. In this drop-down, select the value that best fits to your needs and taste. Personally, the 200% scale is pretty comfortable, as it is possible to see the icons on the desktop clearly. The second option allows you to scale the NetBeans application using the Windows scaling. This will make everything look quite bigger, but it will have some blurry components, as the icons and the splash loading screen. To get started, open another text editor in your system. We will use Visual Studio Code. Don't forget to launch it with the administrator rights. Then, search for the netbeans.com file, located in the etc. directory, inside the netbeans installation directory. Search for the DPA aware string in the document, which should focus the netbeans default options key of the file that contains a plain string as value. Set the value of the DPA aware property to false. Then append at the end of the string the new font size parameter with the value of the new font size. In this case, we will set it to 16, which is quite enough for us. Save the changes and close the file. 
With the previous configuration, it won't be enough to bring NetBeans into a decent use, so we need to follow some extra steps at the Windows 10 level. As first, we will override the HDPI scaling using the system option. To do this, search for the NetBeans executable. To right-click over it and select Properties. Then, go to the Compatibility tab and select Change HDPI settings. On the Emergent dialog, check the Override High DPI Scaling Behavior option and set the Scaling Performance by to System. Click on OK and finally, on the NetBeans Properties dialog, click on Apply. If until this point it isn't enough for you the current size of the interface of NetBeans, you will need to increase as well the scale and layout of Windows at the entire system level, and not only for NetBeans. To do that, follow the next step as well. Although this should be already configured on your system unless you want really tiny icons around your desktop on the traditional interface of Windows, working at the 4K resolution, just to be sure, verify that the scale and layout of Windows is higher than 100%. To do this, do right-click on the desktop and from the drop-down menu select Display Settings. Select the screen with the 4K resolution and go down to the Scale and Layout option. Select the screen with the 4K resolution and go down to the Scale and Layout option. In this drop-down, select the value that best fits to your needs and taste. Personally, the 200% scale is pretty comfortable, as it is possible to see the icons on the desktop clearly. The last thing that you need to do is to adjust the font size of the editor according to your taste. If you launch NetBeans, you will see that even the splash screen is bigger, the icons are bigger, although it will look a little bit blurry. However, NetBeans can be used as usual now. To change the font size, go to Tools and then Options. In the Options dialog, go to the Fonts and Colors tab and set the font size that you want and that's it. Thank you so much for watching this video, please don't forget to subscribe and visit our codeworld.com for more awesome content about software development. Until next time.